Well, I'm not sure I want to tell you where we are because it's pretty, pretty beautiful. Um, we're in Mancus, Colorado, uh, southwestern corner of the state. It's a pretty, pretty special little valley. We're definitely setting records uh, in terms of drought and our lack of, of irrigation water. And there's really no, no precedent for that. A lot of the guys that have, have grown up here haven't seen it this bad, but um, we're, we're certainly starting to, to make a preemptive strike and figure out how to stay alive and stay in business, essentially. I'm uh, Dustin Stein. This is Jake. Do you have a last name? I don't think he has a last name. I'm the ranch manager here at Stubborn Farm and Burke Beef. We're committed to producing food, and so we sell most everything locally here regionally, which is really great to, to be able to sell good, healthy food to our friends and neighbors and help provide for the communities that we live and do business in. So a lot of conservation, I think, has been reactive in terms of drought. Um, I think certainly the younger generation is more, more proactive. It's, it's something that we take a little bit more serious. Uh, you know, and I consider doing this for another 60 years, I'm gonna have to figure out how to manage our acreage in a way that uh, will work with climate change. The main technique I really use is a moisture meter. I take a moisture meter out to where I started and sink it in the soil, and, and if it's wet, I just turn everything off. Technology is, is one of those things that I resisted for years, but the information's out there, and it's always great to come from an, an educated place, and so having websites that might take you 10 or 15 minutes to look at in the morning to educate yourself about specifically what's going on with the water in this valley is a huge tool. So a lot of days you might feel like irrigating just because you can. Um, but to have that in the back of your mind that, that it is an option to shut your water off for a day or a week. You know, even if everyone in the Mancus Valley just turned their water off when their soil was saturated, gosh, I don't, I don't know how many millions of gallons of water we would save in a year, but uh, it, it would be a noticeable difference. In Colorado alone, ag is roughly 80% of all the water used in the Colorado River Basin. And so there's a perception that because they use so much more, then there's, there's more opportunity to take from that bucket than normally is. The problem with that thinking is those are the people that grow our foods. And those are the people that make the fabric of the West what it is. I mean, my, my main focus in life, I think, really, and in business is to just uh, take care of the land that I'm on. So who knows what I'll, what I'll grow or what I'll produce in the future. I just like to be on the land and move some water around and grow some stuff and support this community and um, hopefully pass it on to somebody someday. <laughs>